was the longest rule we've written so far. It would be nice if the magistrate could start using shorter sentences. Bye! Where are you going? Outside to play. I don't think that's a good idea. It's almost dinner time. Oh, please, Mama. I really want to go out. I don't know, Sagwa. I promise I'll be back in time for dinner. Well, all right then. Thanks, Mama! <sighs> Kittens. I got it! I got it! Good one, Sagwa! Go. I can't be late for dinner again. Mmm, I think we're having fish and bai chai. I saw Cook making it before. Sounds good. I'll see you tomorrow. Aren't you going to go home and eat too? Yeah. Yeah. Is something wrong, Fan? Oh, it's nothing. Come on, you can tell me. Well, my family doesn't have much food. We get scraps now and then, so it isn't too bad. But sometimes there isn't much, like today. That sounds tough. It's not so bad. Sometimes we find lots of food. And sometimes, well, we don't. Don't worry, we'll be fine. See you later. Uh, okay. See ya. No, wait! Don't go anywhere, okay? I'll be right back. Oh, it's you, Sagwa. What? You want more food? <laughs> you are not a kitten. You are a little piggy. Oh, all right. But only because you're a growing kitten and need your strength. Take it outside. I don't want the others to get any ideas. enough for everyone? Oh yeah, this is great! So, there you are. Uh, where is everybody? Well, they were on time for dinner, so they've already finished eating. As I recall, you promised to be home in time for dinner. Since you broke your promise, you eat what's left. Plain rice. Plain rice? That's it? Well, if you had been on time, you could have had steamed fish and bai tsai. Now eat your dinner. But I was just... Yes? Oh, nothing. It's not fair. I know I was late, but I was doing something nice for my friend. <sighs> what was that? Fufu, are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. I lost my glasses again. I can't see very well. Can you help me find them? Sure. Sorry about the shuttlecock. I can't seem to do anything right today. There you are, Sagwa. Boy, were Mama and Baba mad at you? They were? How come? Oh, I was late for dinner again. But it was only because I was getting some food for Fan and his family. 
They didn't have anything to eat for dinner. Poor Fan! Well, Mama would have understood that. Why didn't you just tell her? I don't think my glasses are here. Where were you wearing them last? Uh, in the back alley. Let's go there! Hey, Foo Foo, why don't you ride on my back? That way you won't bump into anything. <laughs> Good idea. Not in here! Okay, let's see. Before this, I was flying over the fishing pond. Sokwa! Sokwa! Huh? I just wanted to thank you again for the food. It was delicious. My family says thanks, too. Aw, oh, it was nothing. Nothing? You were late for dinner, and Mama got mad at you. I'm sorry. I didn't want you to get in any trouble. Well, it's not your fault. I'm the one who broke a promise. Maybe I just should have told Mama what was going on. Anyway, we're going to the pond to look for Fufu's glasses. Want to come? Yeah! Stop, Fufu! Huh? Hop on! <laughs> Thanks, Dongwa. Hey, Fan. What are you going to do for food tonight? Oh... I don't know. Oh, what a beautiful pond! You haven't been here before? No, we just moved here a couple of weeks ago. The best thing about this pond is that it's loaded with yummy fish. That's it! Fan can fish in the pond and have more than enough food for his family. Wow! What a great idea! But I've never fished before. We'll show you. guys for teaching me how to fish. It'll be a lot easier knowing that I can just come and catch dinner. Our pleasure. It's too bad we couldn't find your glasses, Fufu. Yeah. Wait a second! Sure he doesn't. Ah. I don't think I'll be 
be losing my glasses now. Finn sure is crafty. What's wrong, Sagwa? I think I need to go back home and talk to Mama. Yeah, that's a good idea. But you know, that was pretty good, what you did for Fan. Thanks. I'm sorry I was late. I'm sorry I broke my promise. I'll never be late again. I'll... Slow down, little one. I saw Fan's mother a little while ago, and she told me what a wonderful kitten you are. And how much you've helped her family. She did? Yes. Why didn't you just tell me what you were doing? I was going to, Mama, but I thought you'd still be mad. Well, I was angry that you broke a promise. But really, you didn't have to break a promise at all. You could have come to me and told me what was happening with Fan, and we could have worked something out. So next time, will you do that? Yes, Mama. I will. I promise. <laughs>